about 30,000 a month for 25 years. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> it's quite a mortgage. Yeah. Uh, that's a lot of pressure. That's why I said it's very hard. Just right now, uh, for, uh, after, bis uh, after we close the business, we still have to survive. And then, so I still have a family to feed. I have two children to send to school. Right. And uh, I, we still have to pay for the rent, I mean, for the monthly uh, amortization payment of the building. Right. And uh, people, come, I mean, this church is, uh, we, not, it's a different from a, a uh, common local churches where mm -hmm. people are there. I mean, they have a sustainable job. Right. Uh, members are always there. I mean, our church is so liquid. Right. Uh, people are so transient, you know. And uh, of course, you cannot expect a lot of uh, OCWs also to to be faithful in their tithes and giving their offerings because. There's a lot of complicated problems, you know. For one year, they have to work and not earn a single centavo maybe for this because all of the money been working for a year will be given to the brokers. Right. And it's only for the second year that they will have their own. I mean, they can save some money. But even then, many are sending money back home so they don't have yes, much here. They have, to, uh, they have to borrow money from here and send money to the Philippines. and. And many cases when they come here, their down payment had been borrowed mm -hmm. and in, uh, with high interest, yeah. you know. I've and heard so, of 5-6 or 5 yeah, that's eight a five, even, six. Yeah, 5-6, that's a very terrible thing, yeah. you know. And so, um, that's, that, that's, real, that's a real situation. Mm -hmm. So we have to keep up the church, we have to, actually, even right now, my wife's still working and not even for herself and not, not only for the family. Are still going to support the church. Right.